I'm gonna try to show you how I made the spiral gradient here in Illustrator. Okay, so step one, I gotta go to the stroke, click on the none, click on the fill, and I gotta go with a color. I gotta select a gray as a default. Let's select the rectangle and create a rectangle. And now I gotta go and select the mesh tool, which is this one. What I gotta do is split it here at the half, something like this. It doesn't need to be perfect. And I also gonna split it from here at the half. And then I gotta split this in half. And this again, add this here, and I'm gonna add one more here. You also can distort it however you like, it doesn't really matter. Now let's select the direct selection tool, and I'm gonna select the top left ones, these four anchor points here, and just choose a color for it. I went with the purple, and I'm gonna select the top right ones. I went with uh, blue, and the bottom right ones, this is gonna be the light blue, the bottom left ones, this is gonna be the red. Now I'm gonna select the center point, press and hold shift. I'm also gonna select these two guys right here and these, and also one of the top. And I'm also gonna recolor it with this pink, but I'm thinking to remake it as some orange-ish actually, something in this nature. Click OK, and I'm gonna select the center points, press and hold shift like these vertical ones, and I'm gonna recolor it as yellow. Now comes the really difficult part, because we're gonna to need to twist these in some weird direction. So I'm gonna select, for example, this blue, and just drag the anchor point, and I'm gonna select this one, and I'm gonna drag it here. So I'm gonna actually recolor them back. So these were it. I'm gonna select the blue, drag it also down, select the yellow, the yellow is gonna go somewhere here, so it is going to create this warp, and I'm just gonna do it with every each, and I'm gonna push this center one at the right, and the purple at the right, but as you can see, it's going like in zigzag, so we're gonna need to straighten these out. I'm gonna select this handle here, and I'm just gonna straighten it. So now it has like a more smooth curve to it. I'm also gonna do the same thing with this, there you go. I'm also gonna bring this purple down. So this process is basically the stylization. I'm also gonna select this handle, curve it, and everything has to be curved out. So basically how it is warping, you're gonna need to curve the whole thing accordingly to the warp. And I'm gonna straighten this also. I'm gonna go with the yellow here, make this straight. I'm gonna speed this up a little bit. And it starts to come alive. We're gonna need to make this more curvy here, more thicker. So I'm thinking to bring this handle out and just curve it even more. So yeah, the more you pixel peep it, the better it's gonna become. And that's how I made the spiral gradient here in Illustrator. Thanks for watching.